Hello and welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Super Carlin Gaming Pokemon X Nuzlocke Challenge. In today's episode, we're just trying to get to the end of Reflection Cave, because I don't even think we've even started to see the, the dangers of the cave. We fought a few trainers. Um, there is more. I think, I just remember this cave having lots of surprisingly hard trainers, but... Uh, I think I want to say there is a nurse in here. Ooh, this might be her. Can we fight you or do you? Ah, yes. Okay, so this is good. There's basically a Pokemon Center in the cave that will just heal your Pokemon. That's very nice. We can go back to her as much as possible. So, uh, as it were, well, I was lucky we found her so early. Um, I'm currently leading with Goyren just because it seems like uh, she is good at fighting a lot of the stuff in the cave. Um, but of course we can always switch out to, um, whoever else we might need to for any situation. The thing is, there are Wobbuffet in this cave, right? That's the tricky thing, because Wobbuffet have this ability called Shadow Tag, which does not allow you to escape the fight at all. Which might not be such an issue, just knock it out, except the only other moves they typically have are mirror coat and counter so whatever you hit them with they're just going to dole back out double if they guess correctly and they have tons of hp so it's likely that you will hit them and then they will hit hard back uh yeah so we have to be very wary of who we think is the best to fight a rogue wobbuffet i feel like fatterhorn would be good because we could just use yawn but the thing is if fatterhorn's not out front it's not going to matter um axe would also be good because we could like smoke screen up a bunch without them being able to hit us so really uh, maybe we should be leading with one of them maybe we should just in just on the off chance we hit said waboof there we go we're gonna put fatter horn up front here Ooh, an item oof the fight you want fight let's do i left my darling fiance behind and came over here all by myself <laughs> i don't care i don't care monami nidorina aha yeah see oh now i wish we'd had goyren out front Psh. all right fats you got this you got this big man let's do it oh it's gonna have poison point that's so annoying Anyway, body slam though. Poison sting. Yeah, we're just gonna get poisoned, right? That's that's the uh It didn't matter. Kaboom! Maybe this will kill it in one shot. Oh, so close! Paralyzed. Love it. We took the poison. Uh-huh. But was she not was poison sting not it must not be a physical attack, because otherwise she, they would have gotten the old rocky helmet to the face. But it's fine. It's fine. It's cool. There you go. Dead. Yeah, fats. Mm-hmm. Do you think her name is... Is Manami a name? Or is it like Monami? Like, my friend. Um, or my... Is that Monami might be like the one I love. I don't know. Is it French? That's what I'm going for. Uh, where's our antidote? Boink. Yay. Right next to the nurse, too. What a waste. Uh -huh. Look, oh, see, so you have to see the stairs in the mirror. Very sneaky. Oh, no, what's this? Ah, Solosis. Mm -hmm. Would have been on the Solosis. That would have been that would have been a real fun one. But alas, I don't think we need to waste our time fighting that thing. There we go. Black Belt. Oh, okay. Okay, yes. Okay, hold on. Let's see. I believe Black Belt is like the it's not fighting moves it's like an item to be held by pokemon this belt helps the wearer to focus and boost the power of fighting type moves like i said it boosts pow power of fighting type moves i thought it increased the like it made super effective moves more effective i thought was that is that a different item anyway i think the only one who has any fighting type moves is fatterhorn with rock smash and i don't think that it's better than the rocky helmet we don't even use it that much or maybe he doesn't even still have it mm, hold on let me just double check see if anyone has a fighting type move 
You ever hear Rocky Helmet? Yep, yep. Mm -hmm. Nope, 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 nope. Never mind. We can't use it at all. It's dumb. Oh, let me tell you about Jude real quick while we're here. Jude, I would say the team largely doing pretty solid at the moment, uh, team wise. I would say the only real thing that is a bother right now is uh, the Juge here. And I, I mean, I think it goes back to Halt's death and Juge sort of coming on as this like, oh, you're the replacement grass type. Oh, okay. And that's sort of maybe the viewpoint of some of the other members. Um, but really, I think Juge could overcome that pretty quickly, except he's just got this serious lack of motivation. Like you can tell, like he's fine if you send him in, but he's just like, you know, Everyone else, like, Halt's death, I think, really spurred on a lot of the other team members, uh, specifically Axe and Chloeo. Um, but, uh, like, it, it, I think it is then frustrating that they're working harder because of one death, and there's this new, new team member that's just not. And it does not help that Juge is also the weakest on the team, which is also probably not motivating for him. Like, it, you know, some Pokemon would be like, oh, I'm the weakest. I need to train harder. Juge is like, someone else could do this fight for me. You know what I'm saying? So that's that's probably not what his voice really sounds like. They can't actually talk. It's just as all just as all just my observations around, you know, when we're when we're setting up camp. Anyway, that's oh, oh, it's a horde fight. Oh great. What's it gonna be? Can we escape it? Oh, it's the Mime Juniors. Hooray. Everybody's favorite. My mom junior, I don't want to fight you. Oh gosh, I thought I was going to say. <laughs> It'd be so annoying if it was like, you couldn't escape. And then we had to sit there and wait five turns worth of them attacking us for nothing. Oh, Tierno or whatever. Oh, man, I'm sorry. I feel like we were going to come up with names for these guys. And I just never did. Fuse the, oh, uh -huh. oh, Flash. Now... Those of you who have been around for the Nuzlocke for a long time know that Flash is... What did he say if we use it? What did he say it did, though? That less Pokemon would show up if we use Flash? Does anyone want Flash? Would it be worth putting on anyone? What I was going to say, so... Mm, probably not. Um was that we had one very specific flash in one Nuzlocke run against the champion. Oh, our beloved Siru, the mighty Dustox, the one you can see right here, used flash as their final move against Cynthia, the champion. Was it Cynthia? Whoever it was. Whoever was the champion we were fighting. And it lowered the accuracy of their Pokemon. And they missed a very key attack. Just it was one miss, and it was all we needed. Oh, our mighty Dustox, mighty Siru, and the big flash. Okay, mime, you're going down. Mhm. Mm Light screen, not gonna help you against this body slam though. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm oh my gosh, you guys, Detective Pikachu comes out this week. I'm so. Uh, maybe by the time you see, when, when will you see this? I might have already seen it by the time you're seeing me talk about it, but man, I'm so excited. It looks so funny. Ah, uh, it looks like it's going to be like a, a good Pokemon movie. Uh, I always like, mm, I've seen a lot of like the Pokemon movies with Ash and friends and whatever. And God, they're just, ah, uh, they're just not very good. Like I want them to be good. Some are better than others, but man, I just watched the one with Ho-Oh that just came out. Uh, I think it's on Netflix right now. Not bad, probably one of the better ones. Also, one of the least canon ones, I guess, because it's just like, mm, these other things happen instead. Ash only really ever caught a Charmander and a Caterpie. Forget Squirtle and Bulbasaur, whatever. Battle! Oh, I should have switched. This guy obviously has fighting type Pokemon. What am I doing? Oh, Sock, good, 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 good. Okay, well, obviously we have to switch off of uh, Fatterhorn. This was a dumb prep move on my part. I am so sorry, Fats. All right, Pokemon, we're gonna switch right into Goyrin here. We got this, man. <sighs> Goyrin does have good defense, which is good because he's our best against fighting types and then you will have physical double kick, oh God. Okay, we made it. We survived the fight. 
what will he do now? Hmm. Now, to see. I would get rid of Cut for Flash. Gotta get rid of these stupid HM moves. Here we go. Psyshock, you got this, Goyron. One shot, one near death. No, oh, very near death. Oh, oh he, has, he has sturdy. What? No. Oh my gosh. Did you see that? He freaking almost retaliated. I was, that was, whoo, whoo. Retaliate, you jerk. We have to remember that uh, future socks might have freaking retaliate. My goodness. Okay, this should be pretty easy. Sturdy. He has sturdy. I ask you. Hmm. Hmm. Cheap move game. Cheap move. Wow. There's a ton of experience, though. I will take a despair. Yeah. Good, good reaction. So I hope you feel like despair. You almost killed Goyrin. Oh, with a cheap move like retaliate, too. Mmm. Mmm. Heal that up. Okay. That's better. That's better. Whew. Okay. We, uh, we gotta be careful. Okay, that guy. This guy looks like he's gonna have psychic type Pokemon, so I'm more okay just leaving Fats out front here to, uh, to deal with. To win! Since ancient times, mirrors have always possessed the kind of mystical powers. I will take advantage of that power and use it to defeat you. I think the mystical power you're talking about is reflection, which isn't really that mystical. It's just what shiny things do. But whatever. Chad Mako! Mm, mm hmm. Well, maybe we should have. Maybe, hmm. Maybe we should have thought about Juge here because he does have payback. But also, we have Body Slam? Uproar! Great, great, cool, fun move. Body slam! Yeah, uh, uh, but, oh my gosh, seriously? That didn't kill, look at, look how big I am and look how tiny you are. Don't tell me you're not dead. Yeah, I get it. Uproar. I, that, I feel like that move, there's something to that move. Like, I, I guess you can't sleep during it, right? Is it better if there's multiples, like in a sw like in a horde battle? I don't know. I feel like there's something more to that move. That I'm always like, do I need to be looking out for this? Fadoran wants to be the rest. <gasps> Probably. Uh, let's see. Mm-hmm. 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 Uh, well, <sighs> it's like, I'd love to get rid of strength. Because now we have Body Slam. Well, Strength is still good, but it's just like some of the Body Slam. You know uh, Yawn, I feel like, is useful. We, I, mm, okay. It's like Amnesia, I like, but we just don't actually use it. And realistically, I think Rest is the better move. So, we're going to do that. We also do have Sleep Talk. So, there is that. Um, which would then, let's see, though. Oh, Snore. Oh, Let's see how this goes. And attack them to use only if the user is asleep. Make the target flinch. Uh, no. Sorry. Keep old moves. Yeah. Because we already have sleep talk, so really, it'd be better to use sleep talk and then maybe get strength or body slam than it would um, to just snore at them, right? Oh, so thing, this thing's part ghost, right? So I don't think we can hit this with... Uh, I think we're going to have to switch. Because I don't think we can hit him with normal type moves. So we're going to switch into Gorun! Oh, mm, everyone's like, ah, Jay, pretty sure that Goyrun's weak to ghost type moves. And I'm now thinking, yes, that seems pretty obvious to me too. Also seems obvious to me that that thing's going down after a single Psy Shock though. So see you later, friend! Probably should have just gone straight into a uh, axe instead of Goyren, but look at that! He's dead. We survived. All my moves were exactly right. Mm. The mystic power bounced back and defeated me instead. Yeah, for someone who studied mirrors a lot, I don't think you really understood the bouncing back part of it. Not that that was even part of that fight, but uh, you know, whatever. Oh, what do you want? Are you that chick's fiance? And she had. Nidorina, so money is on Nidorino. Ready? Ready? 
Did we guess it? Oh no, just where's my darling gone off to? Sob. Mm hmm. Haruto. Aha, called it. Let it read now. Mm hmm. Yep, there it is. Do, 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 do. Which means you're dead. Man, Goyrin just lighten people up lately. Does have that mind plate as well, which is super helpful with the uh, the psychic blasting over here. Boom! Go a little twin nine. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's how we do. There you go. Go Rin. I can't win without my darling. <laughs> okay. That's enough out of you. That, that, look. Oh, God. I. I mm. There's obvious. <sighs> I feel like there must be an item there, but it's uh, okay. Double battle. Hyper potion. Okay. Let's see. Who are we gonna do this double battle with? This is another couple. Hmm. Who should we lead with? Who should we lead with? Let's go with the old fire and water. Should cover a lot of bases, I would imagine. What do you think, honey? Should we share some of our happiness with this young trainer? Do we really look so happy? What? Do we really look so happy? <laughs> Wait, who said? Who spoke second? <laughs> it's like, <laughs> do you think we're that happy? Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, I see. I see what they've got here. Sneaky, sneaky. Okay, let's see. So Vespa Queen has this signature move called Power Gem, which is a rock type move, which is making me a little nervous with Cloeo here. Um, but also Cloeo is probably our easiest bet against killing bug types. Uh, and I st I'm not that worried. It's not like it to be some sort of stab Power Gem or something. And Vespa Queen's not that strong anyway. So we're just gonna focus all of our energy there and maybe it'll die before it even gets to attack. Water Pulse, go! Kaboom! Mm-hmm. And Fire Fang and dead. So Oh Bug Bite. This is a funny fight because um only Oh my gosh, that was so close. <sighs> only female combies can evolve, so uh this chick obviously had some funny idea like, oh, we should both get these. Ha <laughs> ha, yours won't ever evolve. <laughs> okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna fire bang the best Bequin. And it's just gonna die just like that. And then we're gonna, we're also just gonna aim the Vesp, the water pulse here because yeah, just in case, hopefully the water pulse will kill it and then fire fang will just straight up kill Combi. Told you about that power gem, though. That was a little stronger than expected. We're getting fast and loose over here today. Whew. We got him. Comb me down. Thank you, Chloe. Yo. Kaboom. 28. 28 feels like a level Chloe Yo could evolve at. Doesn't it? Doesn't it seem like it? Endeavor. What does this do? This is... I think I know. This is the... Um, An attack move that cuts the target's HP. So, yeah, this is not the kind of move that is really conducive to a Nuzlocke where you're like, yeah, I want to be low HP so I can use Endeavor. Like, this is this is a move that's like very classically attached to like level two Rattatas or something. And people will send them in against much stronger opponents and they'll be like endeavor and then they'll survive down to one and then they'll knock the opponent down to one and then they'll use quick attack and be like ha i went first now you're dead take that but uh we're not going to play such crazy games uh sorry endeavor keep bold moves yes okay we did it we win, hooray, we're the best. You guys are terrible. Maybe you look happy, I don't know. You guys seem up in the air about it. Super potion, fo show, shin. We gotta be getting close to the end of this cave, right? Somewhere, somewhere, oh. Oh, ace trainer, looks like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Who do we lead with? 
I don't hate leading with Chloeo. Goal ring can set up a light screen, I suppose. That could be helpful. Let's maybe do that. Mmm. Well. Of course, Fatterhorn would just be stronger. Maybe we should heal Fatterhorn real quick, just because he's taking some damage. Yeah, we're going to do that real quick. Just in case. Or do we run out? Ah, ah, we're out of super potion. So no, all we have is two hyper. Oh, maybe we should save them. Well, we have rest. Okay, so who to lead with here? <laughs> Let's just go straight up. Mm, straight up axe. No, we'll see what happens. Mm, I, they could have anything. That's the thing. Oh, he's staring at me. This has got to be like towards the end because the ace trainers are pretty good typically. And, well, I say good. Who knows what they could have. I don't know why I'm being so second guessy here. Let's just go straight up axe. We're doing it. This is the safest. My only desire is to brighten my Pokemon's day by defeating you in battle. H trainer Emil and Absol. Oh, okay. Okay. I see. All right. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Totally cool. We're not afraid of you. Water pulse. Bite. Oh, boy. Okay. Oh, oh. Whoa! Whoa, so much damage! Whoa's so much damage! Okay, and we can't even switch into Gloirin here because he's obviously super weak to dark types. Um, um, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, we're gonna go to... Batter Horn. My goodness, do not pursuit! Oh, okay. My gosh, that would have been very annoying. How strong was that bite?! So we're going to 81 down to 53, so. Yeah, take that Rocky Helmet damage. You know what I'm gonna, um, mm, I'm afraid it's gonna use something besides Bite now. Okay, it's gonna use something, and what we're going to use is uh, Hyper Potion right here. There we go. And then hopefully it's just gonna, is Bite it's only double team? Oh gosh, oh. Gosh. You gonna do me like that, Absol? Do it. Do it, Fatterhorn. Fatterhorn? Oh, okay. Oh, you want he's like, come at me, bro. Alright, I don't know if you really wanted that. Oh, we made it. Oh. My goodness. How strong was that bite? The answer is so strong. Actually level 30. Like a boss. Pinsir. Okay, I feel okay with this. Um, body slam, brick break. Oh, 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 oh. Right with a rocky helmet, body slam. Please just kill it. Oh, so close. Um, okay, even that brick break, it did damage, but it didn't do like tremendous damage. And, uh, okay. Harden, okay, okay. I think we're good. Even with the defense boost, he should be dead. Cause we did way more, yeah, okay, we got it. Whew, whew. Ace trainers, abs on a pincer. My goodness, I ask you. What was that? What was that? Ugh. Now, like, we're running low on the potions. We only, we, this is it, basically. Here we go. Use. Boom. We're out of potions. That's it. That's where we're at. Do we have any berries? Sure. You will give one to anyone who's not already holding something. Chloeo, you have an orange berry. Enjoy. An iron. Yum. Boost those defenses. 
Oh god. Okay. Um, you look like that looks like the exit, and this looks like a probably a fight, right? Whose shadow stands on the wall of reflection cave? Tis that of a hiker. Okay. Say so, bro. Whatever works for you. Hiker Dunstan. Sand Isle. So we still have Axe out front, so we should be able to just water pulse our way through this. Pretty easy, I would think. I would hope. Water pulse. Ba boom. Ya dead. Mm-hmm. Yep. See you, Sand Isle. Get out of here. Diggersby. Oh, he's so ugly. Like the ugliest Pokemon ever. My goodness. Water pulse. Yes. Ugly, but lots of free experience. 760, nice. Are we gonna get a second level in like two fights? That'd be great. Level 31 axe. Oh. It's almost maybe even better for us if axe does not evolve until after the next gym because next gym fighting type gym and we're going to pick up the dark type when we evolve and do you heal oh those must be i've never caught any of those genie pokemon at all we made it to shalo city okay cool thanks uh let's see Let's first of all heal. Well, the cave was nerve wracking. Couple of couple of big fights in there, huh? Well, we did it. Now we should see if this town has free stuff for us. What about you? Free stuff? Mm-hmm. Free stuff? I'm not gonna go talk to that man in the pink suit. He's just like, oh, powers. Which I guess are useful, but we're not using them. It seems like anti Nuzlocke. Do -do -do. What about you? Uh huh. Oh, oh my, your frog good ass seems to like you. A Soothe Bell. Oh, that is nice. Well, if we have other Pokemon, yeah, that are friendly best. I guess it could help with getting returned up to maximum strength for, uh, like, either Cloeo or Fatterhorn. Although we already have Body Slam at the same time and that the paralysis is hard to get around. So what do you got? Uh, do you, what are you checking? Okay, thanks. Uh, do, 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 do. Do I get a free item for helping you? Oh, I do. Stardust. Hey, that's like free money. That's amazing. Thank you. Where'd you go, Goyrin? Got us some cash. Putting you to use. Oh, no. Oh, what is this? Is this a fight? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, it's not. Good. The Mega Evolution Guru. All right. All right, whatever, whatever, okay. All right, we've been going for about half an hour or so here. We made it to a new city. Uh, in the next episode, I think we're gonna go learn about Mega Evolution and get a free Lucario, which, um, I guess will count as our Pokemon for Shaylor City. I don't know if we can catch anything else inside the city. I don't really wanna use the Lucario. Um, at all i don't like lucario that much and either way it seems like just such a powerful thing the game just gives you so i don't know let me know what you think should we should we not use it box it at whatever i mean on the other hand, it is very good i mean then other other thing is we're not going to have a mega evolution type pokemon so far not that we couldn't maybe catch one but that would be like a definite i, mm, I don't know i go back and forth on it i don't really I don't really want to use it, but I understand for the safety of the team. Uh, yeah. 
yeah i i would rather not use it but that's where i'm at um let me know your thoughts in the title section down below and uh, don't forget to like the video if you haven't already and leave a comment so that uh maybe you can get another pokemon named after yourself in a future episode thanks for subscribing and i'll see you next time bye